Hi guys, hope all is well. So the coaching insight I've got here in front of me, I'm going to take you through today is titled Communication Basics. So communication has several definitions. So I'm just going to go through a few of those to start with. So the imparting or exchanging of information by speaking, writing or using some other medium. A letter or message containing information or news. The successful conveying or sharing of ideas and feelings and or social contact which isn't happening very much at the moment. It is something we have to do every day with family, friends, colleagues, teammates, even strangers or people we don't know. Sometimes it's essential, sometimes it's necessary, sometimes it's optional. Sometimes it's positive, sometimes it's negative. Such an important skill needs to be developed throughout life in order for you to stay on the path you've chosen. Ultimately, if you don't speak up, no one will hear you. Many of the most successful clients I work with do this extremely well. You can too by following my top tips. Patience, everyone's time is valuable. Some people will take up more of yours than others, some people won't. Being patient with people who may not understand something or they find things difficult to manage, it's a really important skill to master those types of personalities. Prediction. The more often you're in a particular situation, the more likely you can potentially predict where it's going to go in the future. Don't assume, but think forward to how you could possibly direct the conversation to your advantage. Clarity. Keep it simple. No one likes to be confused. Most people who overcomplicate things do so because they understand the least. So simple messages and points of view are often the most powerful. Vision. Consider using visual aids such as videos, pictures, charts or graphs to emphasise the point you're trying to make. This can often be more powerful than saying anything at all. Value. Emphasise the key words that you want to say. Change the volume of your voice and include pauses to increase the value and the point of what you're trying to say. Understanding, be emphatic, even if you don't agree or share the same view. Respecting other people's opinions shows that you respect them, even if you're not on the same page necessarily. You don't have to like everyone you talk to, but you can be curious to them. Positivity, keep things positive. They get absorbed in a better light and can have an increased emotive value for the person in front of you. Nobody likes a downer, even if the situation is negative. So discuss the steps to a solution or trying to improve or resolve the problem. Opinion. Don't underestimate the value of giving your own opinion. Do it in a respectful and polite way, but make sure you say what you think which is very important. Attention, make sure you listen to what the other person is speaking to you about and demonstrate to them that you're listening by looking them in the eye and using the appropriate body language. Follow up, some things don't get resolved straight away, as frustrating as it can be. So if what you're discussing is important, make sure you come back to it when time allows. There's nothing worse than unresolved issues or inconsistency in the way you interact. So next time you need to effectively communicate in any environment, circumstance or situation, consider these things I've just gone through during your discussion. I'd be really, really interested to know your thoughts on this. Please drop me a comment below or send me a DM.